What is up guys, it is the Gaming News Stuff here and today we are having a look at an update that is coming out I believe at the end of this week or beginning of next week for Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. So if we come over here straight to the forums, open this up and then come into the com developer updates, not community, wait for that to load and then go to the first community update, we will see there's a few changes to the Yoda event, which, whatever, whatever, not too important. But, here we go. What's coming next week? Now, they've said they're adding a new character to the Chromium packs. So, for you pay-to-play players, brand new character, who is apparently amazing in raids. And that's CT210408, or Echo, who is a clone trooper, I believe, from the Clone Wars series. And, like it said, he shines in raids, and these are his attacks. He has... Supporting fire, which does physical damage to target enemy, and grants 10, 15, 20% turn meter to another random ally that is less than 50% turn meter. EMP grenade, which does special damage and dispels all positive status effects. That's pretty good. And these other two, by the book, which recover X amount of their max health whenever they use their basic ability for clone allies. And follow up. Whenever another ally uses a basic ability during their turn, Echo has a 20% chance to assist, dealing a blank amount of less damage. This assist is doubled if the attacking ally is a clone. <laughs> now this is all well and good for you people who are pay to play or you buy Chromium packs regularly and you're keen. But for us, or I don't know if you can count me as a free to play player now because I opened one Chromium pack on this video, but either way, for the free to play players we have down here, since Echo is being added to Chromium packs, Cad Bane will no longer be exclusive, which means he'll be available in the Galactic War. That's right. So if you've come into the Galactic War store, you're in here and you've gone, you know, I've already, I've already maxed out my uh, Luminara, I've maxed out my IG-86, maxed out my Captain Phasma, and you don't know who to farm because you're like, oh, none of these really interest me too much. Then, sitting, I assume, right down here, in this bottom corner next to the Magma Trooper, will be Cad Bane. So, for those of you that haven't seen Cad Bane or really looked at Cad Bane, let's have a quick look at him. I do have him, I have not ranked him up at all, but I may have to if he's now going to be available. So, he has this, deal physical damage to target enemy, 25% chance to attack again. Deal unavoidable physical damage if the target's a Jedi, removes all of their turn meter. Scoundrel allies gain 10% evasion. And Cad Bane has 15% critical damage chance, critical chance, sorry, when attacking Jedi enemies. So that's going to be really awesome to get a new character that we can farm. And for you people who buy the premium packs regularly, to get a new clone. You're going to be able to run a full clone team soon at the rate they're going. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this quick little update video and I will make sure to bring you a video when this actually happens sometime next week. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe and peace out.